Okay, come on, here we go. Come on, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Oh, got him, got him. What is it, finally? Come on, come on, come on. What's up, everybody? Today is gonna be my first solo trip in the new boat. And of course, it's pouring rain right now. There's a risk of thunder, but hopefully that holds off. The good news is this rain is only supposed to last for another hour or two. Um, and also that there's no wind almost. There's hardly any wind. So I'm gonna put the boat in and try and launch this thing really for my, by myself for the first time and go out on my first solo trip. And hopefully I can catch some fish. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna be targeting today. Probably pike and bass, or I might move a little bit deeper and try and find some walleye or who knows maybe the walleye are going to be shallow in this awful rainy weather but I'm going to go don my easily inadequate rain gear that I have with me and uh, get this bad boy in the water so the next time you see me we're going to be on the boat. out and probably anchor a little bit yeah I'm probably gonna drop an anchor here in about eight feet of water and uh, see what happens let's catch some fish you see this net this net would have landed me a sweet pike yesterday Look at this pike I tried to tell oh. <laughs> oh. oh he spit it yeah, that's kind of small then. Oh, okay. But I digress. Now I've got it. So no more excuses for losing fish at the boat. I'm not experienced enough to know how this rain, weather, or whatever is going to affect the fish. So, I don't know. Hope I catch something. gear is not adequate for this kind of rain. It's very light rain gear. I might as well as not I might as well not be wearing it. So I was here yesterday with my brother-in-law and it's the first time I uh, ever done any real fishing out of the boat. And every time I've come to Collins Bay or talked to anybody about fishing here in Collins Bay, they always say it's crap. And I just don't believe it. I don't believe the fish in here is crap. I just believe that finding the fish is difficult. So probably over the next little bit while I have this boat and I can move around to different areas and check out different stuff a lot easier than I can in my kayak just because of the big motor. Then maybe I can put together some kind of a pattern here inside the bay where I can come here in my kayak and go to those spots and catch some fish just hit those spots instead of wasting my time looking at all the other areas where there's no fish or at least where there's not likely to hold fish so that's my goal is to prove all the naysayers about Collins Bay wrong because I'm sure I, I know there's fish in here and I proved it yesterday when I caught that super nice pike except I didn't land him so because it's raining you know we're gonna have to deal with some uh, sketchy audio can't have the cameras or my mic out right now, so this is what we gotta deal with. I'm not gonna lie, this is miserable. I've been out here for like an hour and a half in this awful rain and it's starting to wear on me a little bit. Oh, 
Okay, come on, here we go. Come on, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Oh, got him, got him. What is it, finally? Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Oh my gosh. It's a, it's a, it's a really nice pike. It's a really nice pike. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Woo. I'm just gonna let him settle down in the water there. Oh my god. And oh man. Oh man. Holy. Holy. Oh my goodness gracious me. Oh. Oh, oh my god, I can't even, oh, let's see if I can get this guy out of the net and give him a good hold up here, oh man, this is the biggest, this is the biggest play cut, oh. Oh. come on buddy, oh yeah, look at this pike, Oh, look how beautiful he is. Oh my God. Oh, oh man, this is a good fish. I'm just gonna put him down. Actually, I'm just gonna release him right away. Oh, let's just let this guy go here. Oh. And he's swimming away. Swam away. Oh, oh my God. That was a pike. That's the biggest pike I've ever caught. Woo! Oh man! Well, it's been about an 45 minutes since I caught that pike and uh, I am shaking, I'm cold and wet and miserable, uh, but it was all worth it for that one pike. But now I'm gonna pack it in. I'm gonna go uh, pack up the boat and head home because I need to get changed. I need to get warm and get dry. And uh, yeah, so thanks for watching. There's gonna be more videos like this from Collins Bay. So keep an eye out for those. Until next time, catch you guys later.